But uh, looking pretty good out there, a little cloudy, but, but little the temperatures cloudy. are nice. The temperatures are really nice yeah. right now. Uh, we're in the low 70s. You really can't beat that at this time of the evening. It is a little humid, though, and we do have those clouds. But as I showed you earlier, the radar is clear, and we're expecting it to stay clear at least through the evening. It'll be overnight tonight into tomorrow when we see our rain chances really start to spike. So let's go uh, the forecast for the rest of this evening. 72 degrees right now. We'll drop to around 65. That's about it by 10 p.m. tonight. This those clouds fill all the way in. Our current temperatures out in the hill country were a degree or two warmer. They've had a few more uh, breaks than the cloud cover there, 75 in Llano. We're still at 73, though, in Georgetown and low 70s for all of our eastern counties. Right here in Austin, partly cloudy, 72 at Camp Mabry. Overcast, 73 out there at the airport. And our winds all out of the south, right around 10 miles an hour. Now, that southerly flow has really pulled in a lot of that moisture. That's why it feels uh, very different today than it did yesterday, and especially from the the day before. Quick look at our pollen counts. Cedar, unfortunately, in that medium category, while all the other tree pollens, elm, ash, and oak, remain low. And then with the extra moisture, mold is also in the medium category. It is, though, just a little bit down from yesterday. Look across the state. This is what we're dealing with. You notice the cloud cover filled in early this morning and it hasn't broken up at all. And as we go overnight tonight, it'll continue to increase. So what we're doing is we're watching an area of low pressure just out to our west. It's now moving into Arizona. It has some showers over the Four Corners region. That low is going to track into Texas and bring us some decent rain chances this weekend. And in fact, move right across central Texas and move out of our area by Monday. So what we can expect on on Saturday, we're looking at a warm, muggy, cloudy day, some scattered showers early, possibility of some storms through the afternoon. Then by Sunday, the cold front moves through. We will see uh, the front move through early in the day. We'll also look at uh, the chance for showers continuing. That chance of rain, though, is going to be much smaller on your Sunday. Let's go hour by hour through your forecast. This is our high definition forecast or high resolution forecast model. Really great tool we have here. Put it into motion overnight tonight, and you see by Early tomorrow morning, after midnight, before sunrise, we start to see some patchy drizzles, some light showers developing. As we go through Saturday uh, midday, again, some on and off light showers. But by the afternoon, this is 4 p.m., check out the hill country. See the pockets of reds and yellows there? That's a heavier shower activity and even a few thunderstorms that will move east across the region through the evening. Now, Sunday, we get a break in the activity. And then Sunday morning, a few light showers again pop. Possible. Now, with that chance for one or two thunderstorms a Saturday afternoon, there is the potential one or two of them could also become severe. There's a slight risk. The Storm Prediction Center has included part of Central Texas in the slight risk for severe weather. Mainly, we're watching the threat of large hail that will meet most of the air northern areas north of Austin, including Lampasas, Burnett, Williamson, Milam counties. Again, that's just a slight possibility for one or two strong storms that we'll be keeping our eye on through Saturday afternoon. Sunday though that thunderstorm threat is really gone. We'll just see some showers across the area. Tonight, temperatures very mild. Upper 50s out in the hill country. We'll go low 60s here in the metro area and to our east. And for tomorrow, temperatures similar to what we saw today, even with the chance for rain and the cloud cover. In Austin tonight, let's go 61 degrees. Uh, tomorrow, 72. Scattered showers, a few thunderstorms. And by Sunday, a little bit cooler. Only 60s on Sunday. The rain chance wraps up. The sun returns on Monday. And temperatures climb pretty quickly as we look at Tuesday. Look at that, 79 degrees ahead of another weak front that'll move through.